Tonight, a guilty verdict in the trial of a man accused of stealing an ambulance, then running over and killing an EMT six years ago. Good evening. I'm Maurice Dubois. FDNY EMT Yadira Arroyo was killed while responding to a 911 call alongside her partner. CBS 2's Tim Nicholas is at the Bronx Criminal Courthouse with the emotional reaction to the verdict. Maurice, this has been a roller coaster of a case. It took nearly six years to get the case to a trial, and then just one full day of deliberations for this jury to reach a guilty verdict. But we finally did it, right? Yeah. Yeah. We did it. We did it. We did it. Yes. Yes, we did. The family of FDNY EMT Yadira Arroyo is still heartbroken, but Arroyo's aunt says Wednesday's verdict brings her solace. Yeah, all this slew of emotions just, just fell over me. Um, we waited six years through ups and downs, anger, despair, emotion, agony. On March 16, 2017, investigators say Jose Gonzalez stole Arroyo's ambulance under the guise of needing medical help, then ran her over twice, killing her. He was initially deemed unfit to stand trial until a psychiatric center determined last September he is no longer incapacitated. The defense spent the last month trying to convince the jury Gonzalez was so high on PCP he had no idea what he was doing. But prosecutors say Gonzalez acted calmly before the attack and had control over his actions. Six years is a long time, but as long as the verdict was correct and we got justice, I don't care how long it took, we made sure we got it. Sentencing in this case is set for April 5th. Because Gonzalez was found guilty of first degree murder, he could now face 25 years to life in prison. At Bronx Criminal Court, Tim McNicholas, CBS 2 News.